Right, five to five, all the top stories for you at the top of the hour. But let me just uh, bring you this. Spain dropping all COVID-19 restrictions just in time uh, for half term. Uh, let's bring in Julia Lobue Said, CEO of the Advantage Travel Partnership. Good to talk to you again, uh, Julia. Now, um, so all COVID restrictions being dropped. Uh, many people were saying, and I didn't even know there were any remaining. What What were they? Um, The few remaining um, uh, restrictions that are in place for Spain have unfortunately affected the unvaccinated travellers. So that would also involve children um, who are over 12 that were travelling to Spain would still be able to go, but you would have to have taken a test before departure. Um, And Spain is that was one of the last remaining key markets that had this in place. So really good news for families travelling this weekend. So I guess this is going to make a lot of difference, sort of free, uh, a free pass to travel, if you like, just in time for, for what is uh, an important week. It really is. And, and whilst people have probably planned if they were travelling and they needed to take a test, um, it does take away that anxiety and that pressure. So you can travel almost as if we were how we were travelling pre-pandemic. Um, but um, yeah, it really takes that pressure away. And a lot of people haven't travelled for a few years. A lot of people decided not to travel over the summer. So it will be a, a great opportunity for them to really go out there and enjoy their enjoy their time. How are bookings looking? No doubt they've picked up since the pandemic or since the height of what had happened. But of course, we have got a cost of living crisis. So are people having to forego trips once again? Um, with what we're seeing, that, that it's a it's a story of two halves. Actually, we're seeing in one respect, it's quite clear holidays and travel is really important for Brits. Um, we like to travel, we like to get away, um, and that appetite to travel is still really strong. Um, but we're seeing how people are booking has changed. So we're seeing a, a really spike and real increase in demand in bookings through travel agents, and I think a lot of that has come from wanting a bit of security, wanting someone to kind of hold your hand through the process. Things are still a bit different since Brexit. A lot of people forget that. We've got passport changes, et cetera. So um, there's some comfort in booking through through a travel agent. Um, But you're absolutely right. Um, There is clearly concern in the industry that as we're all being stretched, our our pockets are are being stretched, that it will start to impact an industry that has suffered so greatly over the last couple of years. But so far, um, people are still booking. Fingers crossed. All right, Julia, we'll talk to you again soon. Many thanks indeed for updating us on the situation, primarily there uh, with Spain. All COVID restrictions uh, for getting in have uh, now been dropped just in time for the half-term holiday.